pressing down primarily with my left hand. And I'm going to get the footprint that I want. She's making mugs. Ooh. Now that I've got my little disc of clay, this could be anything, I'm going to make a well in the center. And I'm just aiming to go down so I have the thickness of the foot that I want, the bottom of the pot. Uh, so you can test it with a pin tool, like that guy right there. But check the you, thickness. Yeah, check yeah. the thickness. But once you've done, you know, you can feel a few like thousands. thousands of pots, <laughs> yeah. you get a feel for so it. So you yeah. made these today also? Yes, those were made this morning, so wow. they're drying. Um, can't really tell that they're drier than these yet, but... As they dry, the, the lip will dry first, you know, and it'll get a lighter color. So those will they'll get covered up. During the summer, we don't even cover things overnight because we have so much humidity here. Mm -hmm. We just leave mixed those, but this time of year, it's kind of tricky. I see the pot boiling on the stove. I figured that was to help with the humidity. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm going to do a pull. That's the part where it actually gets taller. So my right hand on the outside because I'm right-handed, my left hand on the inside, and then we're going to rest my thumbs together so that my hands move together, roll my fingertips toward each other, and then as I'm moving my hands up, I'm squeezing the clay, thinning it out as I go. And instead of going straight up, you see that I go more in like a little volcano shape. The clay goes out too much. The centrifugal force of the wheel makes it hard to get it back, back in. in. So I want to start out in, and I can always stretch out. And sometimes you do bring things back in, like if you're making an olive oil bottle, which has you know a narrow spout. Obviously, you can't get your hand through a hole that right. Way. But you're still you're trying to keep it as narrow as possible. Another pull. So I've slowed down the wheel. You can hear it is slower than before controlling it with the foot pedal there. Make sure I get it, get the clay from the very bottom so I don't leave extra clay down there that just makes the pot unnecessarily heavy. That is great. I love it. <laughs>